This video tells you about a little known app that was launched in 2013 and suddenly in 2021 has gained massive popularity. In fact, at the time of recording this video, it's at number one in both the Google Play and the Apple App Stores. So why? What is it? What is Signal and why should you be using it like everybody else? Well, Signal's a messenger app just like WhatsApp, Messenger, iMessage, Skype, etc. But why should you start using Signal when I already use another app? Signal is a free secure encrypted messaging app which allows group calls of up to eight people. It also allows group messages of up to a thousand people. But it just sounds like WhatsApp, so, so why, why use it? All communication on Signal is end-to-end -end encrypted. The encryption happens on the device, so not even Signal employees can see your messages. In fact, it's so secure that even if a court order was served on Signal, asking for information on your chats, they simply have no information to give because it's all encrypted. The only thing they hold is your phone number, really. So, as I say, Signal's been around since 2013, so why has it suddenly become so popular? Well, this is because in 2021, WhatsApp updated its privacy policy, which states it will share data from WhatsApp with Facebook. The information WhatsApp will share will be battery level, IP address, browser information, mobile network information, internet service provider information, and your phone number. WhatsApp will not be sharing chat information with Facebook as this is also end-to-end -end encrypted. Also, if you're in the European Union, European Economic Area or the United Kingdom, then there will be no changes to WhatsApp's data sharing policies. In these areas, none of your WhatsApp data will be shared with Facebook at the time of recording this video. So, will Signal start sharing any data? Well, Signal's not owned by a big tech company. It's developed by a non-profit foundation and is funded simply by donations. At the present time, there will be no reason for Signal to share any information with any other company as they're not trying to make a profit. So, how do you get Signal? Well, you can get it on the Google Play Store if you've got an Android-based device, such as a Samsung, LG, OnePlus, etc. Or if you've got an iPhone or an iPad, you can get it on the Apple App Store. Or if you want to download it for Windows 10, you can go to signal.org forward slash download. So there you go. That guide told you a bit about this app called Signal. Hope this guide helps and thanks for watching. You can follow me on Twitter at CWTech, that's at CWTech on Twitter. And don't forget to check out my other videos in my YouTube channel, just Google Chris Waite YouTube. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for your support.